much. Did that help you kind of relax a little bit? You said you might be a little nervous. Did that help you relax a little bit? Uh, yeah, it did. Uh, but like I said, credit my teammates because they were the one who told me to shoot the first shot because I wasn't going to shoot it. And they kept saying, shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. So I kind of just let it fly. And then, um, you know, the second one felt good as well. So, um, you know, just I credit them. They definitely helped me a lot today. Um, without them, you know, I probably would have been all over the place. And they kind of settled me down and helped me through my mistakes and, you know, just helped me be poised out there. So um, it was fun, you know, and I'm just going to. T to have fun with them, especially and grow a relationship with them because you know, it's going to be a long term. Like, you know, we're looking to build a dynasty here, so you know we're just trying to you know learn each other, whether it be on and off the court, or just continue to enjoy each other. You said the other day you wanted to really savor this start. Did, did it hit you that hey, this is your first NBA game while you were out there at some point? Um, kind of hit me. I don't know. I don't know. To be honest, it hit me before we even started playing. Mm -hmm. To be honest with you. Hit me while I was sitting there watching the game before. So um, I just try to go out there and have fun. You know, I think I did a pretty good job of that, just going out there and uh, playing hard on both ends of the floor. So it was just a good time. Do you feel comfortable in the role that they're asking you to play? A little bit of one, a little bit of two, that? Yeah, um, yeah, I, I feel comfortable doing that. Um, like I said, I'm just going to do whatever it takes to help my team in. Whatever they want me to do, I'm going to go out there and I'm, I'm going to do it. If they feel like that's what I need to do in order for us to win. So. Came out with one, so um, just going to continue to listen to the coaching staff, and, um, listen to my teammates, because like I said, they've been through it. You know, so I'm, I'm learning every day. I'm trying to put it all in the membrane up here. You know, so um, um, I'm just going to try to enjoy myself as well at the same time. So I'm just looking forward to tomorrow. And just hopefully, keep getting wins. What's the biggest challenge? I mean, you and you're a two-year entire career down at Wilmington. What's the biggest challenge now? Trying to play the one. Um. I mean, just playing through my mistakes. I think I did a pretty good job of that today. Make sure I don't get too nerd, uh, too frustrated, um, especially bringing up bringing up the ball and stuff when they start pressuring me and stuff like that. But like I said, it's all a learning process. You know, once I get used to that and all that kind of stuff, um, you know, I think I did a pretty good job playing through my mistakes today. But you got to keep going, so I don't make the same mistakes over and over and over. So, um, you know, they're patient with me, but I think times, sometimes I'm not, I'm not patient with myself. Because I want so much of, of me, so I can help my team win. But you know, like I said, I'm just going to continue to keep learning. Uh, credit my teammates. My teammates played a phenomenal game today. Uh, from Mo Hartless to Romero Osby coming off the uh, bench, Rodney Magruder coming off the bench, hitting big shots. Everybody played well today. You know, it was a great team win. We just got the team to keep doing it in order to win the tournament or something. You had that play in fourth quarter where you got in the lane and threw the defense to you and dropped it to KO. Can you talk about I mean, your vision of being able to find guys in the tonight? Um, well, that's the, that's the beauty of being a tall, a tall guard, you know, just being able to see the floor. You know, they credit Andrew for setting a good pick at the top of the screen. Mm -hmm. And then when I take on the big, you know, just keeping my head up. You know, credit Coach Green and working on that at Indiana, just keeping my head up, going off ball screen and stuff like that. So, you know, they trust me. Trust me with the ball in my hands. I'm going to go out there, I'm going to take care of the ball, and I'm going to make good plays to have my team win. Can you bring the fire that uh, fans want to see to uh, keep the Amway packed game after game? Oh, no question. I mean, you just come in. My, um, it's all about energy for me. You know, like I said, the ball finds energy. You know, the energy can change in the game. I think I've shown a little bit of energy out there. Right now, so, <laughs> so, um, you know, I'll definitely have all the fans come out because we're going to play hard and uh, we're going to have fun out there. You know, we'll definitely bring this thing back to where it needs to be. And that's it, man. So I know my teammates are excited about going and building this thing. I'm the same way. Vic, I just asked Coach if it matters, point guard, shooting guard. Does that, does that matter? To me? Yeah. No, no, not at all. Like I said, whatever you want me to play, I play it. You know, you want me to come on ball screen. Ball screen, you set up offense. I say ball offense. Stay in the corner and shoot. That too. So, you know, whatever, like I said, whatever they want me to do, I'm going to do it. Because you know, that's how bad I want to win. I know my teammates feel the same way. Is it naturally kind of a slash with you anyway with those positions? Yeah, I think so. Um, I kind of, it, the slash wasn't there at first. You know, in Indiana, kind of growing, the slash kind of slowly but surely, you know, it came on a piece of paper. So, but, um, and, uh, coming here and Actually, running the point guard is a little fine to slap. So, um, it's pretty cool. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, I enjoy playing the position. 
I'm looking forward to growing at it, you know, and learning all the things I need to learn. Trying to perfect the position. So now that you're signed, now that you're signed and you have a few bucks in your pocket, what's the first big purchase going to be? To be honest, I don't know. I'm I'm trying to win the next summer league game. Hopefully, win all summer long. Then maybe I'll think about making a purchase for it right now. I'm chilling with good car, house. <laughs> maybe a car. Maybe you know, I don't know about buying a house and being crazy like that. <laughs> um, I'm good at the hotel. Hopefully, I can stay there forever. <laughs> <laughs> Clean your room. Your room's already clean. Your bed's already made. It's like living the life. So um, you can hire a maid now. <laughs> I, don't I don't know about all that. That's just more money, so um, we'll see. All right, guys. Thank you. Victor, what's this about the sleeves? Oh yeah, these are pretty cool. I don't know. They're all right. No problem. Thank you.